Calendly Outlook integration. How can you integrate Calendly with your Microsoft 360 account or with your Microsoft Outlook account? Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we will be going over how you can simply integrate your booking solution or easy scheduling with Calendly onto your pre-existing or onto the Outlook interface. So let's get into it. Now, Microsoft 360 provides you with a solution for everything, but that can be a little difficult to manage, especially when you're trying to get a booking system and you're trying to integrate your bookings and your meetings and your schedule directly onto your Outlook calendar. However, that is very easy to do on Calendly and you can easily integrate Outlook into your Microsoft calendar to make it easy for you to make sure you don't have any clashes, to make sure that you are replying to your emails timely and no doubt all of your basic meetings or bookings. So let's get into it. Now, I won't be uh, spending too much time showing you guys the registration process. It's very simple. You will enter your email address or use your Google account to sign up. I already have an account, so I'm just logging into my account, actually. And I will just click on allow over here. And just like that, my account has been logged in. You will be able to see your events. You can see your scheduled events. So currently, I don't have any. And we have our workflows. We have our routing. So this is what the basic uh, Calendly interface looks like. And to integrate this into your Outlook, all you have to do is click on integrations on the top. Now, once you click on integrations, you are going to scroll down and you can actually see a bunch of different integrations uh, that are labeled as uh, Outlook. So first off, you have Outlook for workflows. This is a integration based specifically for sending and receiving emails. This is primarily to send automated emails from your Outlook account. This can be meeting updates. This can be weekly newsletters. This can be for your office management. Uh, and you know, all those basic things can be for this specific plugin. Now, after that, if you go up, you have the Outlook calendar plugin. Now, this plugin is specifically reserved for people that are looking to add their events to their desktop calendar and prevent double booking. So this is to make sure that you have a seamless booking experience or a seamless scheduling or meeting experience whenever you are using Calendly or your Microsoft Outlook calendar. So you don't have, you know, you're not supposed to be in two places at one time. But moving up, we also have another little uh, integration. This is called Calendly for Outlook. Now, this is more so the all encompassing application or integration that enables you to use Calendly on the Outlook platform. So if you want to go into your Calendly, if you want to go into your Microsoft account or Outlook account and you want to be able to use Calendly directly from there, which is, you know, the main purpose uh, for, you know, integrating Calendly into there. So you can easily use this application. So you're just going to click on the application over here and you're going to click on get it now. Once you click on get it now, it will reroute you to Microsoft 360. So you can log on to your Microsoft 360 account. Now I have already logged on. And once you have completed your login process, you will click on open in Outlook app. And this will open up the Outlook application. So you might be wondering, hey, how does the Calendly application actually help me with this? Well, it helps you in a lot of different ways. First off, you can see over here, I have multiple different items uh, in my mail and we have groups, we have folders, we have favorites, all that good stuff. But uh, you guys can see if I click on my calendar, not only can I see my own calendar, but on the bottom left, I can actually see create booking page. So just like that, you guys can see I can create my booking page and get started with my booking. So you can uh, open up your bookings from here and integrate Calendly uh, onto your booking page as well. You guys can see all your calendars. So you have class, you have group based calendars, basic calendars. Then if you take a look at the multiple different applications that you have integrated, so you can integrate multiple different applications and sync up all their calendars on Outlook. And then from Outlook, you know, 
uh, you can easily integrate or schedule yourself one by one for each of those meetings. Now, moving on to the second plugin, which is to add events to your desktop. Uh, this is just to help smooth out your schedule. And we will click on over here. And now after that, you actually have this plugin, which enables you to sync up your Microsoft 360 calendar. It's very effective and easy. And I really like to use this all encompassing sync method to make sure that all of my, you know, when I am looking at my schedule, I'm looking at my phone. So usually in my phone, I either have 360 or Gmail open. So I want to have my calendar synced up on both of those. So I can just click on connect over here. And then this will reroute or schedule or put all of my schedules all together. And now I will just log on to my Microsoft account, click on accept over here. And just like that, my Microsoft Office Outlook has been connected and I will be able to see all of my bookings, all of the meetings that I have directly on my phone calendar or on my Outlook calendar whenever I view it. Now, after that, I also have this configuration setup where I can check for conflicts and add to calendar. So I can click on over here and I can, you know, take a look at the different conflicts that I have. You can check these places for conflict working away tentative or calendar. So let's say I don't want to put in tentative things for the conflicts and I will click on updates because maybe my bookings will take a preference if I am tentative on a meeting or something. So that is another way that you can sync up your calendar. Now, moving on to the final Outlook integration, which is for workflows. Now, this is to connect to Microsoft Outlook and to send and receive emails. Now, this is one of the applications that is available only on the professional version of Calendly. So you guys can see over here, the professional version of Calendly starts at $144 and uh, it's dependent on the number of seats you have. So you guys will be able to see that I have one seat for 12 months. It's going to cost me this per year. And if I want to do monthly payments, that's totally up to me as well. But for this application, you do have to upgrade as well. Now going back onto our Outlook account. So you guys can see this is our little Outlook account and you guys will be able to see all of your Outlook applications and calendars over here. Now in my calendar, I can add a title and you have, you know, all these different applications. Let's say I will mark myself as busy for a specific event. Now I will get this. Then you also have your scheduling assistant over here that will enable you to schedule up items. You can mark this on your calendar and this will automatically be synced up on Calendly as well without having to, you know, constantly update it or do any of those things. And those slots will appear as booked on your booking website or booking page on Calendly. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.